Hello guys, check out this budget Android projector that is suitable for both day and night. Fast and smooth wireless screen mirroring through Miracast. Loaded with 4-way keystone correction and zoom function. And suitable for casual gaming with game console like Nintendo Switch. Interested? Let's have a closer look now. Mid Sundial TD93 Pro Projector. Excellent build quality with sturdy plastic frame housing. Medium in size and lightweight. Simple and nice in design as well. The main lens and IR receiver are located in the front of the projector. Air intake with removable dust filter is located on the right. Heatsink with fan, headphone jack, AV input, two USB port, and two HDMI port are located on the left. Speaker with fabric cover, IR receiver, and power input can be found at the back. Manual focus and hardware vertical keystone adjustment are located on the top. The same applies to LED backlit navigation buttons. Four anti-skid pad and mini stand are located at the bottom. Ceiling mount can be seen after removing the rubber pad. Lastly, this is the mini stand that lets you adjust viewing height. As for accessories, this is the IR remote control. A long and handy one that does the job. For video input, no HDMI cable. AV cable is included only. Power call with EU plug. No worries, you can change it if needed. Finally, a user manual with useful information. Be sure to go through it. Take your time. TD93 Pro is good enough to use during the day. I am projecting at 80 inch screen size with all lights turned on in my room right now. Keep the screen as small as possible for the best experience. Here is 130 inch screen size in a totally dark room. Everything looks much better now. In addition, you don't need a big room to enjoy large screen with small troll ratio. 100 inch screen size at 3 meters from the wall. TD93 Pro performs well out of the box. No calibration is needed on the Android OS. 
for HDMI to reduce the contrast value. That's all. In short, it has excellent colors, contrast, and brightness for a 45% NTSC panel. Nice and smooth image quality thanks to the anti-aliasing filter. Text performance is excellent. You can present PowerPoint to your group member during the work. Texts are very clear, as you can see. For extreme tests, DD93 Pro is performing decently. Center are sharp and in focus. However, corners are not so much when projecting on a large screen. It is very handy to use DD93 Pro as media player. Just plug in USB hard drive, will do. You can play almost every type of video format through software like Kodi. A lot of audio codecs are supported. Subtitle too. Photo viewing is as smooth as butter. Lovely and nice colors. The built-in speaker is decent, crisp and clear. Suitable for quiet room. Hear it yourself. Lastly, fan noise level is excellent. You won't hear fan noise at all during music or movie playback. 1080p input and SDR decoding are supported. And a lot of refresh rates to select from. Video playback performance is about the same between HDMI and Android OS. 24Hz is great and smooth. 50Hz and 60Hz have perfectly smooth playback. That's great! TD93 Pro is loaded with MediaTek processor. It's not powerful enough to play all my usual 4K text contents. Still can play some though. So this video will play back through HDMI with external player. For image quality, it is performing well on both highlights and shadows. Nice colors too. Everything is crisp and details. It is suitable for movie, no doubt. Outstanding performance in this 4K 60p video. Perfectly smooth video playback is what you get. The same apply to this 50p video. Again, perfectly smooth playback.
All right, that's all for HDMI port performance. Let's check out Android 9 OS now. It is using a simple custom launcher. Nice and easy to use. 1 gig of RAM and 8 gig of storage are good enough for daily usage. As usual, you can install the applications and games that you need from Google Play Store. Just use APK method to install if can't find them in the store. That's all. Let's have a look at the settings. Everything is pretty much straightforward. 4-way keystone adjustment is supported. Followed by the usual for projection modes for different type of mounting. Zoom function with 50% to 100% adjustment. Lastly, here is the system information that you might want to know. Picture and sound settings can be found on both HDMI and Android OS. Press the menu button to bring it up. A lot of settings can be configured. Take your time to play around and find the best one for you. The same apply to sound settings. Let's have a look at the most common video app, YouTube. TD93 Pro can play 1080p x60 video flawlessly, but to take note that it is AVC. Miracast wireless mirroring is working smoothly. The response is excellent for wireless connection. Yes. You can share photos and even cast video from your smartphone to the last screen easily. Two point four gigs band wireless is decent and stable. Around one hundred meg is what you get. FYI, Bluetooth connection for external speakers is fast and stable too. How about gaming? TD93 Pro passed the input lag test with this. 39 millisecond response time is what you get. Yes, it is suitable for all casual games. As usual, Pingball is used to test projector gaming ability. Perfectly smooth on the Nintendo Switch game console. And do check out other types of games too.
Shot, Tandil DD93 Pro is a solid budget Android projector that is great for both movie and games. For the price, you can't go wrong with it. Interested? Please use my referral link to shop. It will help me a lot. And do check out my top projector chart too. Don't forget to subscribe and thumb up. Thanks. I'm Jace. Glad to see you around. Peace.